Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm kind of quiet right now because it's 7 a.m. in the morning, but today is my 13th birthday. Oh, I just woke up and today me and my mom are basically going on a day trip to Raleigh, which is around four or three hours away from my house. If you know me, then you know I'm like a grocery shopping like fanatic. Never, all I ever hear anyone talk about is like Wegmans, Wegmans, Wegmans. And so it's in Raleigh, the closest one, drive up there and go and also go to other like fun places and stuff. So I thought I'd take you guys on the journey. We're leaving today and then we're coming back tomorrow. So I thought I would vlog it and show you guys what I got for my birthday. My mom did decorate my room a little bit. So yeah. Guys, I just opened all my gifts. So I thought I'd give you guys a little mini haul because I didn't get too, too much because usually I get like most of my gifts from my parents, I guess, but my gift this year is going to Raleigh and cause like we bought a hotel, we didn't buy a hotel, we're getting a hotel and everything. So I thought I'd give you guys a little haul. So first I just got like money from like my aunts, uncle, grandma, grandparents. And then from my mom, cause she got me like little, and my dad, I always say my mom though, cause we all know our moms are the ones that buy most of the gifts. Um, but my dad just writes his name on it. But I've been wanting this book for so long. When I was in PHP, they read it, but I fell asleep during most of it. Um, but it's Life Without Ed. It's very popular. And so I really wanted it for myself, so my mom got it for me. She also got me one more thing, because I feel like it'd be weird if anyone else got me these gifts. So it was just my mom who got me this, but she got me a spoon. And it says my name on it. And then right here, you can't really see, it says calories don't count on this spoon. So it's super, super cute. And it's tiny too, which I love. My sisters, I got a puzzle. I love puzzles so much. This one, the theme is things I ate as a kid. And it it's a thousand piece. A whole bunch of like retro foods and snacks and stuff. I love puzzles. And I don't even know who got me this, if I'm being honest. That sounds kind of bad. But I got coconut bowls, which I've been wanting forever. It comes with two of them. They're kind of big, but you know, they're cute. I like them. And then also it came with two coconut straws. The cleaner also came with it. Um, two coconut straws and then two coconut forks and then two coconut spoons. So, so excited. And lastly, I got a golden hour light. I'll try and show you guys. Dang it. I need a plug for it. I can't show you guys that. So that was just a waste of time. But I got a golden hour light lamp. So super excited for this. And that is my haul. Super grateful for everything. So for my special birthday breakfast, my mom went to a gluten-free vegan bakery um, yesterday and she FaceTimed me and I saw something that I liked. I got a cinnamon bun roll, whatever. So I just have to take it out and microwave it. So I'm so excited to try this out. I love cinnamon rolls. Oh my gosh, look how much frosting there is. It's probably gonna all melt though because I have to put it in the microwave because um, I had to put it in the fridge, so it's not like pretty hard. So it's probably gonna all melt. Like, look at how much frosting there is. Also, I told you guys this, but I got a new tripod, and this is actually from Five Below, and it's way like better. I love it. Oh my gosh, look at all that frosting. Definitely a fair food, but it's my birthday. I can do whatever I want. <laughs> I'm gonna try this baby out. It's like a pretty dense. Oh, good to me though. So we are just about to leave now, so I thought I'd give you guys a little OOTD. So I straighten my hair, even though my hair is always, like already very straight, and then I cannot do my hair to save my life. So my mom did two little braids, and then I have this pink shirt that kind of looks like polo-ish from Brandy Melville, and then my mica necklace, and then another one the counter. If you're watching this, mom, my feet are clean. I have this skirt, which is actually like a score, it has like pants, from a thrift store. So that is the birthday fit. So we are now at an all like vegan vegetarian restaurant in Raleigh. We made it here, it's called Spotted Dog. It's just me and my mom, by the way, if you didn't know, on this little day trip. And so I got curry with a soy chicken and it comes with rice and pita. What did you get, mom? Black eyed pea burger. 
And then this is my plate. This curry is so good. I've only ever had like frozen meal curries, but now this is like my first time having like a real one, like at a restaurant, like a fresh one. Oh my God, so good. And the pita bread is also like so good and crispy. So right next to the restaurant we were eating at, there's this grocery store, not Wegmans, but another grocery store. Never heard of it, we're checking it out now. I've already found like two new things, so pretty excited. We are now like trying to drive to Wegmans and it's already like two o'clock, but we can't even get into our hotel until three. And we we're seeing a Whole Foods, so we're just stop stopping by Whole Foods, even though we have a Whole Foods near us. It's okay, we're stopping by. We're finally here, guys. I'm in actual heaven right now. And we are now at the hotel. So my mom just went to go get ice for some of the cold stuff. So I thought I'd give you guys a little haul. Also, we are going back to Wegmans tomorrow. Relief, because there is like frozen stuff and there is no freezer here. We're just gonna come back tomorrow. So I am getting more stuff, which I'll probably do another haul. But so far, this is what I got. I got this acne cream, nothing special. And then I have got these Quesadin Farms chickpea brownies, which I saw before and I wanted them. And then next time I went to go buy them, I couldn't find them anymore. And then I got these overnight oats. I see a whole bunch of people like are sponsored by these and I want to try them out. This is the maple brown sugar flavor. So you basically just um, put water in it, keep it in your fridge overnight, and then boom, you have overnight oats. And I thought this would be good for school because my school starts this Monday. Lentil a vegetable soup when soup season comes. Because right now it's a bit too hot. And then I've got some Nancy's oat milk yogurt. I really like this yogurt. It is very hibiscus hibiscus flavor. I've never seen this one before, so I wanted to try it out. I then got a Chobani oat strawberry vanilla yogurt, because I've never seen the non-dairy ones before. I then got a protein Kite Hill yogurt in the vanilla flavor. Then got these butterscotch dairy-free puddings by Wayfair. They look pretty good. Me and my mom wanted to try them out. I got, I got one more yogurt by Almond Breeze. Um, Blue Diamond, it is a dairy-free yogurt. It's like a Chobani flip, kind of. Pretty excited to check this out. Then got these Hail Mary um, cups. I got this sweet potato one and the chocolate peanut butter one. Very excited to check this out. Then got this vegan birthday cake blondie. This looks very good. I'm so excited. Then got this small seed cocoa brownie. Also looks very good. <laughs> Not all of this is from Wegmans, it's from Whole Foods. This one other store that we went to that I don't know. Then I got these Greenhouse Foods mini chocolate donuts. So excited for those. Try not to say the same thing over and over yet, but I just I'm just so excited for everything. I have teen cookie dough bites from Eat Pastry. They're the chocolate chip cookie dough flavor. And then I went to this one restaurant the other day and they also sold like bars up front. And my mom's coming back if you hear any sound. Um, but they had these bars, so I tried them the other day and they were amazing. And I found them again at Wegmans. I only found one of them though, but so excited to have that again. And then also this little secret crispy dark chocolate wafer bar. I've had this before and I really liked it, so I just want to rebuy it. And then also this Vega protein snack bar in the blueberry oat flavor. And then I've never seen this before. It's a apple cinnamon fruit bar with Betty and Louise. So I've like never seen any of this stuff before, so that's why I'm, like, I'm so excited. This Rule Breaker deep chocolate brownie. I got this Joker candy bar. It's peanut caramel and peanut nougat and a chocolatey coating. And this other candy bar of a caramel or fluffy chocolatey nougat and a chocolatey coating. And that's what I got. We are getting more stuff to get the present stuff, so I'll do another haul when that happens. I had some birthday money that I wanted to spend, so we're now at Target to see if I can find anything I like. So 
we're now at dinner and I got the orange chicken tofu and it has like rice and green beans and then the tofu and then like mandarin oranges. Looks pretty good though. And then my mom got a stuffed pepper. So hopefully it's good. My lunch was so good. So hopefully even better, I don't know. The waiter gave me a free cheesecake for my birthday. It's a vegan cheesecake. I'm gonna have a few bites of it. Probably may or may not eat too, too much of it because we do, we might also try and get a cake. So we just got back to the hotel. I'm exhausted. My mom's watching 16 Candles. And I actually had a bite of that cheesecake they gave us at the restaurant. It wasn't the best. I think it was hazelnut. I'm not the hugest fan of hazelnut. So I got a cheesecake from Whole Foods. It's a chocolate chip cheesecake, which is a huge food, but I love cheesecake so much. I'm gonna try this out. And, yeah, and dinner also wasn't horrible whatsoever, but it was nothing compared to lunch. Lunch was so good. That cheesecake was so good. And I think I'm gonna go to the shower because I'm exhausted and then go to bed. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow though because we're doing a little bit of stuff tomorrow and then we're going home and then we're going to end this video. But, yeah. So it's the next morning, still super tired. I did not sleep good at all because the airport is right next to our hotel. So all night we heard them going like landing and then going off. But I'm in a little slim flub dress. There is a free breakfast out at the hotel. My mom just went down there um, when she first woke up when I was still sleeping because see, I don't know if you could hear the points but because she needed coffee but she said there's not too too many good stuff down there so just in case i'm gonna bring these donuts with me because it's like the only i didn't bring any food with me so just the thing i bought I, if i would have donuts just in case but yeah, we're gonna go see if there's anything good down there so i'm not trying to be dramatic but like this is my guest being not ed but there was literally nothing down there and so i'm gonna eat my donuts but the donuts really aren't enough so I'm going up to my room and getting like one of those custards that we bought um, to try those out. Um, so yes, I guess that's gonna be my breakfast. Got custard and donuts. So I'm kind of stupid and I forgot to film my breakfast, but I had, you can look on my TikTok if you really wanna see, but I had the three mini donuts that came with three in the pack and they were like chocolate covered. They were pretty okay. Don't think I buy them again. And then the custard was actually really good. That came in a four pack, so I have three more. Pretty good. So we're about to get out of the hotel and then we're gonna stop by Wegmans again to get our frozen stuff. And then we're gonna start heading home. So we're now at Wegmans one more time to get some frozen stuff. I actually took pictures of it on my phone when we went yesterday so that I'd remember the frozen stuff I wanted. In it. So it's like 11.15, which is a bit earlier than I usually eat lunch, but we just stopped by at Panera, and we're just gonna eat later on in the car around when it is lunchtime, because this is like the last stop for food, and then after this, there's like no stops, it's all just So we now got our Panera, and I'm about to eat, so I first got the barbecue chicken salad with no chicken, and I love the salad. And then I also got the Mediterranean half sandwich because I got the pick two half salad, half sandwich. Um, I don't really want to take it out because it's going to be a mess, but yes. Because I literally just finished my lunch like five minutes ago, yes. But I'm not even hungry, but I want something extra sweet. And of course, I'm like so anxious to try out one of the new bars I bought. So I'm trying out the Vega Blueberry Oat Bar. Okay, so we are now home. So I'm gonna give you a little haul of the stuff that we got the second time we went to Wegmans. So like all the mostly cold and frozen stuff. So these aren't cold or frozen. It's just I didn't see these the first time. But Flower Off Bars, because these two flavors I do not have near me. And then, even though I haven't even tried out the first one, which was the strawberry vanilla, I wanted to get the peach mandarin flavor of the oat Chobani um, yogurt because, I don't know. And then, I saw this super weird thing. Um, I don't even know what it is, like a pudding, I don't know, but it's a spoonable avocado super cocoa, so I guess it's like a sweet avocado pudding and when you saw on my breakfast i had that butterscotch pudding and that was really good and i've never seen those before so i also got a vanilla one they came with three other ones but they're in the fridge 
And then for more frozen cold stuff, I got a Toferty ice cream sandwich. It's, it's very melted as you can see because it was in our car for like three hours. And then I got a Daya caramel ice cream bar. I'm gonna put a picture of the box somewhere around here because we threw it away. And then I got a So Delicious ice cream bar. This is the peanut butter chocolate one. Also, we'll put a picture of the box right here. And I got these Dream Pops in the cookie dough flavor. And I wanted to try these for so long now. If you like watch my TikTok, you know that not a moo ice cream is like my new obsession. And I finally found the Rockiest Road flavor. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. We're gonna switch places now because my other frozen stuff is in my garage. So I'll show you guys that. So also on the second stop that we went to Wegmans, I forgot to show you guys this, but these are not frozen things. So I got this I coconut milk soup. For when soup season comes again, because I love soup. Then this Garden of Life peanut butter chocolate protein bar. And I had this before and I absolutely hated it. But it was the first ever protein bar I've ever had, which was like, like two years ago. I like it this time. I got this good to go cocoa coconut bar. And then also for a school breakfast, because I just want quick, easy things for breakfast and for school. I got this granola smoothie bowl, which I think is like overnight oats and you just like add water. I don't know. But now on to the other frozen stuff. <laughs> Welcome to my garage where my outside freezer is. So these are most like frozen meals. So first, this is mostly by mom who got this. Bye bye, I'll try it out too. It's a garden medley veggie burger. I don't know, I might like this. I don't know. I'm gonna try it out too though. She says it's good. And then also, she's 100%, million percent not watching this, but shout out to Linda Sun because in almost every one of her videos, she eats Bing, which her mom makes, and then everyone who does, like, eating like Linda Sun for a day, always, like, tries to recreate Bings, and I am not creative whatsoever to do that, but I found that they make Bings, so I got these frozen veggie-filled patties. They are not authentic, obviously, but close enough, you know? Like, I'm so excited for these. I got this Mediterranean-style frozen meal with falafel in it, and I love falafel so much. So by that same brand of frozen meal, I got this Moroccan style frozen meal with chickpeas and spiced cauliflower. Also excited for this one. Then I also got this tofu scramble by Amy's. And I've never had tofu scramble, but I've heard a lot of good things about it. So excited to try this out. Thing also by Amy's was this Thai green curry. I've seen this and I wanted to try it out. So I got it. And that is my haul. That was my trip adventure for my birthday. I'm gonna end this video here now because I'm home now. Nothing new and exciting is happening now because I'm exhausted and now I'm just gonna rest. But thank you for watching this video and yeah, please like, subscribe, and comment if the comments are wrong because my comments always like to be annoying and turn off. So bye.